Police chiefs from across the state today came out against legalizing recreational marijuana. And it's not just because it's illegal under federal law. As two on your side's Claudine Ewing reports, they're really worried about the effect on the roads. The State Association of Chiefs of Police represents over 500 police chiefs. They've seen it all, and collectively, they are against legalizing recreational marijuana. The big concern is traffic safety. States that have legalized marijuana have had uh, seen dramatic increases in traffic fatalities. Uh, the statistics are there to, uh, to prove it. Um, Colorado itself saw a 62% increase in traffic fatalities the first year they legalized marijuana. As the opioid crisis continues, law enforcers are concerned. What happens if a driver is impaired by the use of marijuana? How do you know? It's difficult to test. The only way to really test for, for the presence of marijuana is to draw blood, which you know you can't do on the side of the road. Uh, obviously, you can run, through, uh, run a driver through standardized field sobriety tests, but then to confirm the presence of marijuana is not easy. Drug recognition experts are used, but it's a highly specialized training, and there's a shortage. There are very few. Uh, I mean, for instance, my department it is a hundred person department and we have two. Most small police departments don't have any. The enforcement of, of driving under the influence of marijuana is going to be very, very challenging, uh, if not impossible. He doesn't think legislators will change their stand on the issue and so police officers prepare. We know for a fact we're going to see an increase in traffic fatalities. We'll, we'll train our people as best we can. He says some drug dogs will be retired because they're used to detect marijuana. Claudine Ewing, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Claudine. Chief Phelan says that the law enforcement would have to add approximately 650 new drug recognition experts to handle the necessity of the increase in suspected impaired drivers out there. And he points out the State Association of County Health Officials is also against legalization, calling marijuana a gateway drug.